Isaiah chapter 60 and it's going to be the last verse. Somebody is saying amen today by the grace of God a new chapter is about to open up in your life. Amen. A new chapter is about opening up in your life. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Isaiah chapter 60 verse 22. A little one shall become a thousand. Amen. And a small one, a strong nation. Amen. I, the Lord, will hasten it, or quicken it, or accelerate it in his time. Amen. While I was praying, and as we were running up, the voice of his majesty came to me and said, this is the agenda of God. Amen. A little one shall become a thousand. Amen. That means in your little state, you will be achieving thousand results. Amen. Achieving results as if a thousand people is doing it. A little one shall become. And this is in all dimensions. There are people here, they will be, you know, where I came from, the cost of people three in one of one meter. But from scripture now, it's talking about a thousand, a thousand in one. I will speak, he said, the Lord of your Father increase you a thousand times more. A thousand times more that the God of your father increase you a thousand times more. So, a thousand times manifestation is God's agenda. Now, why am I sharing this with you? Because as we are singing, we were singing standing on the promises of God. And this is the promise of God. Amen. And now, as we are standing on it, we are activating the performance. Yes. Deuteronomy chapter 1 verse 11. Look at the prayer. Moses said, the Lord God of your fathers, make you a thousand times so many more as you are, and bless you as he has promised you. Make you a thousand times many more, a thousand times order of increase, a thousand times order of achievement, a thousand times order of resolve. And God said, I'm not going to use the mighty, a little one. A little one shall become a thousand. I'm going to turn that one called little into a thousand. I'm turning that man called little. There are people listening to me. Now I'm sharing this with you because as we round up this financial empowerment series, you are holding on to something, the promise of God. Amen. You are standing on something, the promise of God. Amen. That means whatever be your highest level now is going to be your least level forever. Amen. Your business result now will be the least you will achieve in this year. Amen. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. from the text we have been praying from since the beginning of this financial empowerment, a little became a thousand in the hand of that woman. Amen. A little. She said, This is one. The Bible says she even picked little stick to eat and to die. And she told the prophet, This is the thing that remained. And after this, we are dead, me and my son. But that little became something. Amen. Till the day when it came, the little did not finish. Amen. That is the agenda of God. And therefore, I want you to pray this scripture letter for later. That Lord turn me little into a thousand. Mm. <laughs> let me achieve a thousand times result. Mm. I am turned little, but let the result coming out of my life become a thousand times more. Mm. I don't know if you are getting what I'm saying here. Mm. They look at Jesus, they said, No, he, well, his brother is not here with us. Of course, we knew his brother, but the result he was achieving was a thousand times higher than whatever they knew about him. Listen to me. The people that know your story. They will have to rewrite your story again. <laughs> oh my God. The people that have been telling the story of when you began, they knew you. They said, hey, you know, I was there when his mother was sitting. We were the one that sent him to school. Thank God for their, their, their assistance. But they will have to change their mind. Because they will realize that, no, it is not that same you they used to know. Because God said, a, thou, a little one, and God is speaking here, a little one shall become a thousand. Shall become a thousand. Can I tell somebody something? Don't think where you are now is where you head. If you can stand on the promise, he has spoken that a little one, no matter how little we are, get ready, get ready. Because now we are little. We are becoming thousands. Amen. Not by scent, but look at what God said. A small one will become a strong nation. Amen. Not just a nation, a strong nation. Amen. Not just a nation. That your little and small business will soon by the word of the Lord become the talk of time. Amen. It will feed nations. Amen. It will sponsor nations. Amen. It will be on the headline news of national TV. Amen. 
in the name of Jesus. How will this thing come to pass? He said, I, the Lord. That is the one that excited me most. I, the Lord. I will because I have the capacity. I am little. I am small. So I can't. But God said, it is not about you. I, the Lord, will instantly in his time. Will, there is always a time but you receive and activate it now. Because the Lord will arise and have upon Zion upon, upon for the set time to favor her. Yeah! The set time. As what? As what? How many moves time has come right now? Lift up your voice and pray. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. I'm standing on your promise. In Isaiah chapter 60 and verse 22. I am a little one. Make me a thousand times more. From today, no areas of my life, let me achieve thousand times order of results, thousand times order of achievements. Lift up your voice and begin to pray. I refuse to be small. I refuse to be limited. I refuse to be behind. I'm standing on the promises of God in my finances. Make me a thousand times. Make me Achievement beyond my ability. Achievement beyond the people I knew. Achievement beyond my background. Put me into here. God is in it now. Let there be a performance. Now is the time somebody can pray. Pray yourself out. Pray your breakthrough out. Pray your business for the next level. Pray your destiny spiritually. A thousand times more spiritually. I want to begin to achieve a thousand <laughs> Somebody pray for empowerment center. Turn this small place for a great nation. Turn this small place for a great nation. In fact, it's no longer a small place. Turn this great church to a great nation. <laughs> the God of your father increased you a thousand times more. A thousand times more. A thousand times more. We step into the reality of a thousand times more. Thank you, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. As the Lord has spoken, you will have a testimony. Yeah. It doesn't matter what they have called you now. You are small. You have no power. You have no one. You even look at yourself, you laugh. Say, hey, can I make anything happen in life? But God said, a little one shall become a thousand. Amen. That means in their little state, they will achieve results beyond their size. Amen. 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 My God, my God. I heard people spoke to me on fruit. And when they come around to see me, they say, We are looking for Pastor Bentley. I said, This is Pastor Bentley. I said, I mean, Pastor Bentley. I said, This is Pastor Bentley. He doesn't look bigger than this. This is not his size. You know. Many times I've been embarrassed having been invited to some place and said, oh, yeah, expecting one big man. <laughs> now, as I was praying now, I just realized that, wait a minute, your size does not matter. No. Yes. When it is about God, I'm talking about God. Yes. You, you may look little, but what God will be achieving through you will be beyond your age. Yes. I speak into your lives in the name that is above every other name. That's what I enjoy and a thousand times higher than anything I'm enjoying in life. May God release upon you. Because he's put to us and we are standing on his promises in your finances, your businesses, your spirituality, your marriage, even concerning your children. They will achieve results beyond your age. Achieve results beyond your ability. Because God will turn you a little one into a thousand. Your small one will
will become a great nation. There shall be accomplishments. There shall be performances. He said, I will estimate every word that has been delayed in your life. Promise of God that has been delayed in your life. This week, as you say, Amen, I command performance instantly. Performance is speedily. Performance is speedily. Every promise you have been standing on that you are yet to receive the testimony. Every promises of God you have been standing on and you are yet to receive the manifestation. This week, as you say that loud and clear, it will happen in your life. Amen. God will prove himself as God in your life. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. And by this word of Lord has just spoken, that in this empowerment center, mm. raise people Amen. that are wealthy thousand times higher. Amen. Financial giants Amen. that will build school for people that does not have. Amen. Financial giants Amen. that will build churches for people that does not have. Amen. Financial giants that will send children to school on scholarships. Amen. Financial giants that will lend to nations. Amen. Financial giants that will build hospitals to take care of the needies. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Financial giants that will rebuild their family house that nobody could build again. Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father.